Let's learn how to engage and disengage the BD Facile injector from other mating components, such as the BD Facile protector, connector, infusion adapter, or infusion sets. To engage the injector, connect the injector to a mating BD Facile system component. Then, push, turn, and push. Hold the injector at the white finger grips and the white portion of the mating component. Line up the wings of the injector to the notches of the mating component. Be sure not to touch the blue portion of the injector. Next, push the injector into the connection interface. Then, hold the white finger grip and turn clockwise. Finally, push down to engage. To disengage the BD Facile injector from a mating component, pull, turn, and pull. First, hold the injector at the white finger grips and the white portion of the mating component. Next, pull the injector back from the connection interface until it stops, exposing the blue portion on the injector, being sure not to touch the blue portion. Hold the white finger grip and turn left or counterclockwise. Then, pull the injector to remove it from the mating component. Let's examine the procedure for preparing a syringe from a single drug vial. Before beginning, prepare a BD Facile vial assembly. For reference, please see the module on Building the Vial Assembly. You'll also need to prepare a BD Facile syringe unit. For reference, please see the module on Building the Syringe Unit. First, engage the syringe unit to the vial assembly using the push-turn-push -push technique. Keeping the vial upright, push the diluent or air into the vial. The expansion chamber will inflate. If reconstituting, follow the drug manufacturer's package insert. Invert the system and aspirate the drug into the syringe unit. The expansion chamber will now deflate. Then, disengage the syringe unit from the vial assembly using the pull-turn-pull -pull technique. The syringe unit containing the drug is now ready for administration or further preparation. prepare an IV bag using the BD Facile infusion adapter, you'll need an IV bag and administration set, if priming the line in pharmacy, plus a BD Facile infusion adapter, and one or more prepared BD Facile syringe units. For reference, please see the module on preparing a syringe unit. On a flat surface, spike the IV bag with the BD Facile infusion adapter. Ensure the spike of the infusion adapter is fully inserted by confirming the port of the IV bag is up and over the shoulder of the infusion adapter. If the IV line is being primed in the preparation area, open the blue cap on the distal end of the infusion adapter and spike the administration set into the infusion adapter. Then, prime the line according to the manufacturer's instructions or your facility's policies and procedures. If required by facility protocol, lure lock an injector to the end of the IV administration set. Next, engage the prepared BD Facile syringe unit to the connection interface on the infusion adapter. Engage the syringe unit using the push-turn-push -push technique and push the drug into the IV bag. Finally, disengage the syringe unit from the infusion adapter using the pull-turn-pull -pull technique. Repeat the steps if additional syringe units are required for dose preparation. The IV bag is now ready for administration. Next, we'll demonstrate reconstitution with 100 milliliters of diluent. Before beginning, you'll need a pre-assembled BD Facile vial assembly and two 60 ml BD Facile syringe units, each prepared with 50 ml of diluent. For reference, please see the modules Building the Vial Assembly 
and building the syringe unit. Engage the first syringe unit onto the vial assembly using the push-turn-push -push technique. With the vial on a flat surface, inject 50 ml of diluent into the vial. The expansion chamber of the protector will inflate to full capacity. While the first syringe unit is still engaged and the vial assembly remains on the flat surface, pull back 50 ml of air from the vial into the syringe unit. The expansion chamber will now deflate. Then, disengage the first syringe unit from the vial assembly using the pull-turn-pull -pull disconnection method. This syringe unit can now be discarded or may be used for further preparation if the final dose required is greater than 50 ml. Next, engage the second pre-assembled syringe unit onto the vial assembly using the push-turn-push -push technique. With the vial assembly on a flat surface, inject the second 50 ml of diluent into the vial. The expansion chamber of the protector will inflate. Reconstitute following the manufacturer's package insert. Invert the vial and aspirate the drug dose into the second syringe unit. Disengage the second syringe unit from the vial assembly using the pull-turn-pull -pull technique. If the dose required is greater than 50 ml, use the first syringe unit or prepare an additional syringe unit with 50 ml of air and engage it to the vial assembly using the push-turn-push -push technique. Inject the air, then invert the vial and aspirate the dose. Disengage using the pull-turn-pull -pull technique. The filled syringe units are now ready for further preparation.